Okay, folks, today I will be doing both a review for the um, PlayStation Vita system, which came out this past spring, I believe, and uh, also Madden NFL 13, which dropped a, a couple days ago. Um, start with the system. PSP Vita. Right here, it's got the new uh, dual analog. You know, PSP didn't have the analog. Um, a little smudge. That's a bubble on the screen protector that I need to uh, need to rub out. Um, backside's got like a little design on it. It's pretty much the um, you know the button design, the X circle, square, um, triangle, and all that. But uh, you can do some touch stuff on here, and then I guess uh, these are kind of like a little grip thing. Uh, still got the two buttons um, on the top. It's a camera um, back here, and another camera is the uh, little dot right there above the uh, buttons. Uh, start and select, and then the new uh, the home button. Uh, volume is up here. These two buttons, you know, up and down. Um, power button is here. Uh, this slot that says PS Vita on it, you flip that up, and a uh, game just go in there. It's actually a little uh, little card. It's kind of like a, uh, um, I guess like a Nintendo DS, but uh, actually a little bit smaller, um, surprisingly. And uh, the other slot, I'm not sure what goes in there. I think somebody I work with said a, uh, um, shit, some type of other card. But the uh, the memory card, um, there's a little, you probably can't see it, a little thing that opens right here. The memory card goes in there headphone jack and then this right here uh, it's how you charge it it's kinda like a, a phone charger little prong thing uh, plugs into the USB the cords actually pretty big um, anyway turn it on you hold the power button down for a few seconds there it goes turn it on Okay, screen with uh, the time, you know, the date and all that always pops up. A little Bluetooth thing up here. Um, battery and another time thing. Uh, to make this screen go away, a cool thing about this compared to the PSP is it's got a touch screen. Shit. Guess I talked too much and went to sleep on me. Uh, anyway, you grab this little corner, just like a piece of paper, pal, gone. Uh, it's reading that I do have uh, Man 13 in there. Background is a uh, custom. You can't even see all the apps that are on there. Uh, Netflix, Facebook, YouTube, uh, Twitter. It's actually a live tweet. Uh, PlayStation Network, Madden's the one bouncing up and down. And then, of course, photos, music, videos. Um, actually scrolls down to other pages. Some other app stuff on there. And you got your PlayStation trophies and all that. Oh, and if you notice, each page can have a, a different custom background. I think it starts off blue, or mine did. I changed the background to uh, black. Then each page you can have a picture. That is uh, downtown Cincinnati skyline on there. And then that's uh, inside Paul Brown Stadium, where my uh, beloved Bengals play. Um, anyway, hopefully I don't have to log in. We'll uh, start up Netflix and see what it does. Won't uh, run through YouTube because you guys are pretty much uh, on YouTube anyway. Oh, gotta hit the start. Most of the things you open, you gotta hit start on them. You can't hear any sounds from it uh, because I'm wearing my headset. Sorry about that. Okay, connecting the PlayStation Network. Um, all the applications you download through the uh, PlayStation Network under the apps, um, Netflix, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and all that, it's free. Um, but of course, things like Netflix, you obviously have to have your uh, monthly account that you pay for, you know, for it to work. Come on. Search, search in the uh, Wi-Fi. Okay, so it, uh, I mean, it loads a little bit slow, the instant queue and all that. What have I, uh, what have I been watching recently? Shut it down. Um, some stuff I've watched recently. Little George Carlin, Platoon, Apocalypse Now, and all that. Um, let's do George Carlin jamming in New York. And that pops up. Uh, resume playing. Actually got jamming in New York on a CD somewhere. 
Okay, it's loading. Turn the volume up a little bit. I mean, it actually streams pretty well. It doesn't hardly freeze up or anything. I don't know if y'all can hear that. Yeah, George Carlin, stand-up comedian, died about four years ago. I mean, my webcam's not doing that justice. I mean, that's a fucking... It's a clear picture on that thing. I know it looks white and blurry through my webcam. That's perfect. Um, anyway, to, get, uh, to close the apps, as far as I know, I, I got this the other day before I got Madden. Um, you hit the home button, and that pops up, and then you just pretty much peel it away, and it goes away like everything else. Um... I'm not going to pull up YouTube or Facebook or Twitter or anything. Um, sorry, I'm not going to demonstrate the camera or anything. Let me go ahead and uh, let me start up Madden. Calvin Johnson, the Megatron, on the cover this year. Um, Case that actually came in. A little bit, uh, a bit smaller than a uh, um, PlayStation Portable case. Let's see how big that is. Oh, um, it's also got, I don't know if you guys have heard about it, it's on the console version as well. Um, Ray Lewis, little opening video. Y'all probably can't hear that. Yeah, we don't need to watch through that, you guys can find that video on, uh, on YouTube or wherever. Okay, make sure my PSP is still on. Let me, uh, because I was going to demonstrate um, last year's game. This was the PSP. The systems have been out for seven years. I'm sure some of you guys have checked this out before. And then uh, compared to the Vita, um, Vita's in this hand, obviously. A lot bigger, um, bigger and better. Well, I mean, it's thinner than the original PSP by a little bit, but, uh, you know, bigger screen, a little bit easier to hold. I'd already started a game on there because I wanted to try and uh, do the graphics, check in the storage media, just like anything else, it's got to load all of your stuff before it um, completely co uh, comes up. Um, obviously it doesn't have the new Infinity Engine that the uh, console versions have, but it's still nice. Um, I got my custom team set as the Bengals, but it seems like every time I'm on the menu, a random team pops up. So right there is uh, Jacksonville Jaguars. Yeah, that really looks like shit. Gameplay is going to look horrible on this camera. I apologize for that. Um, we're going to play now. Exhibition. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do the first game of the regular season this year, which is going to be the Bengals at the Ravens. Plus, that's what I've got set up on the PSP. And we'll set up screen there. Settings. I mean, honestly, I, I love this thing so much. It's just like having a damn console in the palm of your hand. Um, some of you guys see me on here making videos before. I do have a uh, Xbox 360, but because Microsoft and um, shit, let's call them back in a minute. Come on. So while that's loading, please don't fall. Oh, there it is. Okay, I'm on the toss. I'm going to kick because that's how it's doing on the other game. PSP looked nothing like this. Seven years of PSP games, Madden. They never looked like this.
I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. I got it cranked up as loud as it goes, but with the headset. Probably can't tell. Okay, I'm going to pause that for a second. Because I'm also doing the kickoff on the PSP version. Hey, look how shitty this looks. Well, damn, it looks even worse. It's gonna run one play for each so you can tell the difference. You can't even really tell on the PSP. But yeah, that looks horrible. Yeah, Ray Rice got blew up there. Anyway. And I wasn't even controlling the dude just just because the Ravens suck. One thing, if you tilt the uh, the uh, Vita around when you're trying to kick off and all that, the arrow moves so you can hit calibrate. Anyway, come on, focus. Damn it, this camera does us no justice. Gonna reach up and do a random play. Let's do a cover, cover two. I'm not gonna make any adjustments or actually run the play. I'm trying to let you guys see how it looks on here. Yeah, it looks like shit, but hopefully you can tell it's better than the. Uh... Wow, Ray Rice got blown up on that too. I wonder if it was the same play. Oh, check it out. I don't know if you guys can hear the commentary, but I mean they do the lineups and everything. That yeah, looks like the console. You can tell the they got the new uniforms on here too. Let me get closer. Yeah, that that doesn't help. But anyway, personally, if you guys like handhelds, I mean the picture's even clearer. In fact, the camera, my camera just makes it look bright. It's not bright at all. Shit. Ray Rice got a big gain on there. Damn, that was 20 yards. Anyway, go ahead and pause that. Um, I'd recommend picking one of these up if you're a gamer on the go. Uh, it goes through Wi-Fi and all that. You can play online. Um, when the first game I played, the night it came out. I mean, Madden's Madden. If they don't really change that much, um, pretty much blew the dude out. He was using uh, Pittsburgh. Believe it or not, he kept trying to throw deep to Wallace and... Kept swatting them and picking them off, and I was throwing deep to uh, AJ Green, Muhammad Sanu, Jermaine Gresham, and all of them. I think it was like 21 to nothing or 21 to three or something when he quit. But um, that don't matter. You can take these online. Um, if you guys want to hit me up, I guess uh, it'll it'll uh, you can't do uh, these don't link between the PS3 version. So um, if you do a franchise like you do uh, on MLB The Show or anything, it don't transfer over. But, um, like I said, I still recommend picking these up if anybody wants to play me online. My name is, uh, that was my PlayStation name. It's like Fear to Tiger 08 or something. Um, F-E-A-R-D-A-T-I-G-E-R-0-8. -E um, follow me on Twitter at MatroBuzz, hopefully. Um, with the shitty camera setup that I got here. Um, you guys find this review helpful? Maybe not. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Give me some feedback. I can answer any questions you guys got. And uh, peace. Check it out. Go Bengals and all that. Who day? Alright, so I'm not happy with all how that came out with my webcam. So I'm going to try and refilm some of this stuff for you guys with my digital camera. And hopefully it looks a little bit better I film through this. But I will guess. I guess we'll see. I mean, it looks better on the digital camera right now. I'm sure once I edit it into my other footage, it'll look even better. Come on. I mean, loading time might seem a little bit slow. 
I just hit start game before I started filming. There we go. We're here at m and Bank Stadium for this afternoon's matchup between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Baltimore Ravens. Hello, friends. Okay. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. And, well, this is a matchup. Uh, we've certainly seen it a few times, and it's always a great one when these two get together. Well, it is. For so many reasons, we got two coaches <clears> out there. They're not afraid to take chances during the game. And we, and we cover so many games for the coaches. They won't take a chance. They don't try anything special on special teams. They don't go for it on fourth down. That will not be easy today. Man, the new commentary is one of the like amazing, too. In the game against the defense that has really struggled stopping the run. Yeah, they really have struggled this year. And I'll tell you what they're going to do today, Jim. They're going to gamble. They're going to put extra defensive backs up there near the line of scrimmage and dare the team to throw it. But, you know, when you run the football well, you use the those extra right, kick off again. It's not going to stop anything. They're going to run that football right at them anyway. Okay, I'll get closer than that. I mean, to me, it looks just like a console. Camera's still not doing it justice. I know some people on here still got better footage. The Ravens attack. Number five, quarterback, Joe Flacco. Right, Joe Flacco can throw that ball. What else you need to know? If you're open, he can get it to you no matter where yes, you are on the field. Number two. Right, we'll pause that real quick and go over to the PSP and resume the game that I had going before over there. We'll turn the volume up. <coughs> okay. Shit. Okay. This is what it looks like on the PSP. This is Madden 12. Very choppy and freezy. Goes from that play to you picking the next play. Nothing special there, no cutscenes or anything. Let's go back over to the Vita, Madden 13. Again, I'm not controlling anybody, it's automatic. He's at me on hand with something. I mean, shows the starting lineup. Great commentary. I mean, that that looks like the console to me. Number two. Let's see what they do here. Manny Lawson. Yeah, I can't get any closer than that. Back to the running back. Shrugs off the first hit. That tackle was made at the 27 yard line. I mean, to me, this it looks amazing. New you know, Nike jerseys, Nike logo on the sleeves. Not every team's got the shiny uh, thing on the v neck, but these two teams do. You can clearly see that. I mean, it moves fluid. It looks way better. You get them both going at the same time, see what goes on here. Go back over to the PSP. Of course, you could still hear the PSP a little bit louder, or the, the Vita a little bit louder. See, the Vita already ran the next play. Oh. I mean, that looks like shit. But let me try and do a little something over here with the punt. Oops, I got that with him. Well, I can't hold the camera and do the controls at the same time. But Andy Dalton, the red rifle. Alright, the pause menu. And then on the boring ass PSP. Yeah, um, hopefully this helped make the review a little bit better. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. I don't know if it was like an extra six or seven minutes. Sorry for the length. 
But um, I figured if you guys are going to watch the whole video, you deserved a little bit better than what I did before. Um, so yeah, comment, uh, subscribe, uh, send me messages and all that, you know, any questions you might have. Uh, if you, hope you found this review helpful, and uh, maybe you guys can add me on uh, PlayStation Network and we'll play a game, tweet me, Metro Bus, like I said before, PlayStation name, Fear the Tiger 08, F-E-A-R-D-A-T-I-G-E-R-0-8, and Twitter is uh, Metro Bus, M-A-T-T-R-O-B-U-S. Alright, catch you guys later.